So Yahoo has had just incredible global reach. Uh, it's one of the most loved brands around the world. Uh, and you know, it reaches the far corners uh, of the planet. Uh, I'm wondering if you, you can relay some of your favorite stories in terms of the impact that Yahoo's had and some of the lives that have been reached uh, around the globe, uh, far corners of the earth where you're surprised to encounter it or hear stories that they were using it or how they were using it. Well, I, I remember when I go out and speak in the sort of mid to late 90s, Marissa, I would always ask, you know, how many people have heard of the internet? You know, 10 to 20% of people raise their hand, and you say, how many people heard of Yahoo? Like, you know, a few of those. And then I just remember there's one meeting in 97 or 98, it was kind of a speech to God knows who, and, and it was um, like everybody in the room, or 80% of people in the room have heard of Yahoo. And, and that was kind of, that was the last time I asked that question, but it was also kind of this, you know, my gosh, it's, um, it's not some size show, it's, it's, it's kind of gotten to the mainstream. Um, I've been really lucky uh, as part of Yahoo to travel around the world and um, I forget, it was, um, this was not for Yahoo, but it was, on my, it was I think, one of my few um, getaways. It was, I was in Botswana and, um, you know, had the satellite phone on the solar panel and try to, you know, can't be out of touch, right? And, um, and, um, and, and one of those, you know, guides in the, in, the, in the jungle was basically asking me, and, and then he found out I was from Yahoo, and, and he started to tell me how like, it really changed the way they communicate with the outside world, how they were able to um, be you know, literally in a camp in the middle of nowhere and, um, and be in touch. And, and it's you know, those stories times 100. I know we, um, we used to get a lot of stories of, from our users that we, I think, tell, um, we collect and tell people. And, um, and it's just the power of, I think, having um, a brand but also a service that really is critical to people's lives. And I think that's something that um, certainly I never thought would be possible when we started the, co the company. Yeah, I mean, I think when we first started, actually, we weren't even thinking about this beyond ourselves, really, for our own use. But I think it was a month after we wrote the initial, uh, published the initial pages, I think a month into it, we looked through our logs kind of for the first time and noticed that there were 30 different countries represented. So we were creating something totally in English, totally just for ourselves, and all of a sudden we had people from 30 countries using this thing. And that was probably the first time to really dawned on us that this had kind of use beyond just our simple needs. So. Yeah. 